This is a clip from my Patreon. To watch the full video and many others, click the link in the description. I think the whole documentary was building up to the finishing scenes, clips of which were promoted on social media before the documentary actually dropped, where we see KSI and his dad having a very personal conversation, really, about uh, the amount of love, or to put it more accurately, the lack of love, that KSI experienced growing up. During this in-person conversation between KSI and his dad, we're introduced quite quickly to the perspectives of both men. We're shown that whilst KSI is an expressive, emotional man who's quite keen on sharing how he feels, KSI's dad is almost the polar opposite, quite reserved, with it even being implied that this is a very first for them. Not, not just a first for them sitting down and talking about their relationship, but a first for them even sitting down together without any other members of their family present. Really, the first time they've ever been alone together. That is if you ignore the Amazon sound, lighting and camera crew. <laughs> the concept of you and your dad coming together for the first time, having a really deep talk, potentially expressing the most emotion you've ever expressed to each other, and the entire time it's being filmed for Amazon Prime, really feels like a stark reflection of the dystopian online image-ruled reality we're currently living through. Yeah, there was something very, very odd about that to me. Very odd. It quickly becomes quite apparent, quite evident, throughout this uh, conversation that KSI has with his dad, that his dad is quite heavily influenced by generational trauma, whether he knows that or not. He's very defensive, very quick to combat anything KSI says by comparing it to his own upbringing. Jide speaks on uh, elements of his relationship with his own father, who apparently beat him until he was 21 years of age. All in all, it really doesn't seem like the two men are on the same wavelength. It almost seems like they're having two separate conversations. One person is saying this, and then another person is sort of like, instead of being present in the conversation, saying, oh, okay, is that how you felt? Is more so saying, well, this is what happened to me. And it doesn't seem like they're both in a place where they're really ready to understand each other. But the conversation is happening regardless, because let's face it, it makes for great viewing. And that right there is a vibe that I really took away from this. It's it, it seemingly as though nothing is going to change with this father-son dynamic. It doesn't seem that way at all, really. But it's very evident that this whole conversation is going to create more views on the documentary itself. And I almost feel like as long as that is the case, it's probably not going to be a problem, which speaks to the amount of dysfunction that probably exists within KSI's family.